All right, Joshua here with Wanderfoot, adventure number two. We are in Joshua Tree with one of the co-founders of Bonita Domes, Gabe, and his partner, Lisa, who is not here right now. And uh, can you tell us a little bit about Bonita Domes? Well, Bonita Domes is our uh, beautiful dome home here in Joshua Tree. Um, it's a private residence uh, that we've been building now for about four years. Um, also on, located on the property is we have some pod vacation rentals, a couple of nice pods and a shower house and a little outdoor kitchen for a little glamping experience for, for those who are coming into Joshua Tree for Joy the Park. So as you can probably see from the structure behind us, this isn't your traditional home that you usually see. So what, what is this made out of and, and why did you choose this building method? Well, the, what these are made out of, all in the walls right down to the plaster that you see is the earth that we're standing on here. Um, it's a method that we, we learned at a place called Cal Earth and um, it's, it's, it's a coined super adobe or earth bag construction. Years ago, we, we wanted to build sustainably and find something that, that was a little bit uh, more earth friendly. So we did, a, did all of our research and we found Cal Earth and, and we were just really excited about the architecture that it provides and uh, the finished result is just, uh, it's just phenomenal. There's something special about the, the round shape. I mean, I think we're so used to being in square spaces and like when you come into one of these domes, it just has such, a, such an inviting, just, yeah, the sound, the light, everything is just so organic. And, and most of all of us have grown up living in a box of some form or fashion. And if you really look back through history, that's not where we really evolved from. We're very cave-esque and very dome-esque. Anywhere from the indigenous people to the ancients have built um, this way in some form or fashion. So I guess it's just a sense to to uh, try to experience some, something new and thinking out of the box and taking taking the power back. You know, this is something that everybody can do with the earth under your feet. Um, it takes it, it takes a little elbow grease, but you can definitely get it done. And it's empowering to put that power back into the people and to build your own sustainable building and to, you know, make your surroundings even sustainable as well. I mean, it doesn't get much more sustainable than taking the earth from your site. And I mean, you don't need to ship materials in. I mean, it's in most sites in the world have, have soil. And it's really just empowering to sh reshape the earth into your, into your house. As the earth turns to gold in, in the, the hands, hands of, the of the wise. Thank you, Rumi. Rumi, yeah. <laughs> Thank you, Rumi. And it's the truth. All right. Yeah. Well, make sure to come visit Bonita Domes when you are in Joshua Tree. Thank you so much. Bye-bye. Bye-bye. <laughs>